So a framing issue that we have is this header here, since we had to drop this duct out of the floor joist, this trunk line, supply line, they had to shoot it right through where that header is to keep it up against the ceiling. And so as a result, we don't have a header here anymore. What we're gonna do is we're gonna cut it here, cut it here, make a header, and then put some cripple studs in there to make it work. Should be a pretty easy fix. measure up we'll cut them instead of tearing the whole thing out well now you've made a weak point well, well we'll cut it here cut it here and slide that header in there cut it right there okay Straight edge, there's a level up there in the garage against the far wall, blue. Or my red level's right here in this garage, right? Yep. That's all I need. That's why I left you. Yep. There you go. Do I need to get the uh, small sledgehammer and my flat bar? My big pry bar's up there in that uh, uh, wheelbarrow on the garage. Wheelbarrow. You know what a wheelbarrow? Better be careful. That's slipping out. What is that header on top? Yeah, the header on top is fixing to come out. It's totally moving. Uh, it's not there. It's not connected up there. Nope. Watch out. Feet square flying. I hope that wasn't important. Oh! 
That's not good. Did it break it? Oh, you just beat it. Yeah, it broke it. Well, it's not broke, it's just big. Is it big? It's broke. Huh? All right, we're going to have to get some of that. No, it's snapped. Did it? Yeah, you can see the crack in it. We're going to have to get uh, some of the insurance approved duct tape. Save that. Yeah. That was such a good speed square. I think it's the one I just bought, too. Probably. That's all right. That UL rated yeah. tape. So it needs to be 80 or 38 and a quarter, that header. Needs to be at least 39 inches long. Nail gun anywhere over there? Yeah, but it's not hooked up by any power. Oh, they should have nothing that. Same. To put four or five nails in, I would hope. Here we go. Should be tangled too much. Sorry. Oh, we got another bottom. All right, let me find the extension cord because you'll need some more juice. Oh my gosh, it's like we measured it.
Jigman. on the other side. And I don't think she'll go anywhere. You need to see more? Right. We're going to put one more over here on the side. We're going to run a cripple stud all the way up that side. Trust you was measuring if there's something wrong. Twenty inches. Good possibility, yeah. Yeah. So I don't blame you. Trust me, that trailer will be filled as soon as I get there. <laughs> Won't take long. Nope.
All righty, so that should fix our header problem. This is our load bearing member now. That up there is doing absolutely nothing. This is our load bearing member. Load here, load here, and then load here from the top cord at the very top. Um, and that should function fully for framing purposes at the non-load bearing wall. That should work.